From mannequins with blinking eyes and pulses, there she goes, to a virtual lab with scans of real human bodies. Everybody gets really, oh, this is so cool. M State's new simulation center brings new tools to the educational operating table. Because it looks a lot more realistic. They can feel pulses. So instead of just saying, pretend you would feel this or pretend we would do this, they actually get to do it which I think makes a, a huge difference in their learning. And they are a lot more excited to be with these simulators than the old school mannequins that don't really do anything. Dr. Erica Berg is the director of practical nursing at M State. So when you push down on it, they're not gonna have that pain when you push down, but as soon as you release it, that's when that pain is gonna happen. She says that with the simulation center, the college hopes to bridge any knowledge gaps from classroom studies into real practice. We can simulate real life scenarios in here in a safe environment uh, so the students can practice hands on procedures, um, treatments, medication administration um, with these patients at the bedside before they go into the real world. Along with the mannequin simulations that give students a chance to practice working with a patient, the virtual cadaver lab gives them a new way to look at a human body. I was able to rotate the human heart as, as it was pumping to see the back of the human heart. And I said to the students, unless you are a cardiac surgeon and you're working on heart replacement or valve replacement or bypass yeah, surgery, you're never gonna see the backside of a human heart. With all four M State campuses set to use the facility starting yeah, in the fall, can, yeah. the simulation center will be an important part in teaching the next generation of nursing students. Derek Finkston, Campus News.